Hey everyone, how's it going? So today I'm gonna do a video that everybody's been asking for and that is of my Eagle Industries Arrow. So uh, without further ado, let's go ahead and jump into it. So up front here, I have a double M4 Eagle Industries pouch. And inside here I can hold two M4 mags each. So a total of four right up front, just a little bit to my right. I have a Eagle Industries uh, smoke grenade pouch so I could hold like uh, no gaze in here thermal barracks anything like that we'll go in here just fine uh, a little bit over to the right well actually before I even get to that I also left uh, the kangaroo the built-in kangaroo pouch that came with my arrow I've left that flat so in case I wanted to put a insert in there I could but the main reason is it's a big compartment and at uh, games like Milsom West or anything like that, when you have uh, important documents, it's great to store them in here. It has a little bit of Velcro up top to close it, but the rest is lined with uh, like a Hypalon material, like off the JPC uh, shoulder straps. So there's no dividers in here. So it's just one big open pouch. So it's great for stuff and uh, things like that. And if you don't know anything about this carrier, if you're to look at it, all my pouches and my, uh, my admin pouch kind of cover it. So you would have no idea that it's there which is really cool. A little bit over, I have a uh, Eagle Industries frag pouch, and that would hold uh, like a pea grenade or anything like that. Right now it's holding a piece from a hydration bladder, which I'll get to uh, later on in the video. A little bit over, I have my, huh, my sword tourniquet pouch. I love this pouch. It's on pretty much every carrier that I, uh, that I run. And then a little bit over to my other side, I have a tier tactical. M4 pouch and that holds uh, two M4 uh, mags so I can have a total of six mags up front I also have the money belt uh, cummerbund so I can have more magazines in the cummerbund if I absolutely need to I've never needed more than uh, seven mags really uh, it's always lasted me quite a while so I usually stick with that up top I have a Eagle Industries admin pouch with a built-in uh, flashlight pouch uh, the flashlight pouch is rather big too, so you can probably stuff uh, a mag or two in here too, a pistol mag or two, uh, and you'll be just fine. There is a less, little less keeper inside. Uh, you have some molly in the front of the Velcro. I have a Spartan Village uh, multicam flag patch right up here. But once you open it up, you have a small compartment with some uh, elastic keepers inside here too, so you can probably fit. Uh, pretty much anything you want in there. You could probably fit a couple pistol mags in there too, honestly. Uh, it's a pretty substantial uh, size. And then you have, uh, behind that, you have an even bigger admin area. So it'd be great for something like a wallet, keys, uh, you know, a larger map. Maybe that uh, carcass of that bird that I'm gonna kill. But uh, behind that, you have the Eagle Industries built-in admin which again, if you didn't know anything about this carrier, you might not know. However, it's not a very big admin. It's something like the size of uh, like a CPC or an AVS, any of the cry carriers really. Uh, so it's, it's a very slim uh, admin pouch. So I probably would only want to suggest to put like uh, flat pieces of paper in there, anything like that. Uh, the UPS guy is coming in right now, so I got something else cool for you guys. But uh, anyway, the last piece of the kit that I got with this uh, carrier was my source hydration. Now, uh, I kind of went with something a little different. Uh, I wanted to try something a, li a little uh, different again, uh, something I haven't really seen before. Now on the back, as you can see, it's slim, and it's like that for two reasons. First reason is I don't have a zip-on panel for this carrier, which I'm planning on getting uh, sooner or later, but Eagle Industries lead times are like six weeks to eight weeks, and they're extremely expensive. Uh, and also, I like to run backpacks, so if I keep it slim, it helps with that. And then I just have a Do Not Pet patch on the back that I got from eBay for like eight bucks. But uh, anyway, you can see that the hydration actually goes inside the carrier, and it's actually inside this big area and then it runs around and goes inside the plate bag and that's the way it's designed 
is to uh, hang out by the plates. And it's a three liter. It's a three liter and it actually has the little hydration going out the side instead of coming up top or angled up top, I should say. But uh, yeah, it's pretty cool. The only downside is the fact that I will not, uh, you'll not, you're not gonna be able to fill it to the three liter capacity when you're wearing this carrier. There's just no way. Uh, you'll probably be able to fit about one and a half liters in there. But other than that, uh, this is gonna be pretty much it. Or that's gonna be pretty much it. And the way you actually fill this one up is it comes with a separate little nozzle up front here. And you just click this one off. And you take this little piece, clips inside. You let gravity do its work and you squeeze that water bottle and it goes right down, which is pretty neat. So that way you don't have to take anything off, you don't have to worry about anything, and you're good to go. But uh, yeah, that's pretty much it for my carrier. If you have any questions or comments, you know where to leave them. Make sure to like, favorite, share, and subscribe. Um, I'm gonna put a link down in the description below for my sponsors, Samapo Gear, Molly Monkey Tactical. Uh, there's gonna be links for the, you know, like their Instagram, their Facebook, their store pages, all that, all that kind of stuff. Links are gonna be down there. I'll put a link down in the description below for my Instagram and my Facebook. Uh, definitely check me out. I definitely, uh, I post a lot on Instagram, probably about uh, three to four times a week. Facebook, not so much. It's usually a good outlet for me to post my uh, my videos so you guys know firsthand, or you guys know uh, when I post a, a video, it's always on Facebook as well. But uh, as always, have a good one.